We are extremely proud to have been the host of the 2013 Saudi Spanish Youth Dialogue Forum at IE School of Architecture and Design. Under the umbrella of the custodian of the two holy mosques, King Abdullah bin Abdulaziz's initiative to enhance bilateral relations and to promote dialogue among other countries and cultures, the Saudi Ministry of Foreign Affairs held the Saudi Spanish Youth Forum with the purpose of knowledge and technology exchange. The chosen theme for this year's forum was architectural identity, preservation and promotion, where issues of mutual interest to both countries were discussed. Architectural preservation and patrimony can open a lot of opportunities for youth. The first way is through enrichment of culture and understanding each other's culture. When we see in buildings in our built environment what we have in common and what, what is artistically also different, it gives us a chance to compare ourselves with other people and that helps for understanding. In specific terms, when we look at architecture in the future, preservation is a field that's really important and will get become more and more important. Um, in the practice of architecture, it's not just building new buildings, but it's also respecting our heritage and finding creative ways of incorporating new activity into old buildings. And I think that's uh, one of the challenges that will be um, facing our youth, but at the same time, it's a great opportunity. After an introductory lecture, Saudi and Spanish students were divided into four workshop groups for two hours addressing Saudi Spanish society's collaborative design, Arab Hispanic heritage, real estate, and workspace matters. Today was very enriching for us. It has been really interactive. We learned a lot from you, and you have really contributed to our initiatives that we're going to present to the king later on. Well, I think design is all about solving problems, and in order to solve problems, you need to understand other people's needs and other people's requirements. And then, and to do that, you definitely need to spur conversation and understand about other cultures and other other situations. It's absolutely important. We're learning a lot from your expertise and knowledge. Uh, we've been really astounded with the Spanish architecture and how you managed to preserve your heritage throughout this time. It's very enriching to us and we will definitely take whatever we learn from here back to our country. I think architects uh, should think about not only in the conception of the projects but along the long life that uh, real estate projects are going to have. And they also have to think about which are the persons that are going to be involved in each part of the value chain. So uh, in every time they do a conception of, that, of uh, any real estate project, should take those people thinking about and do the inputs that they're going to need to have a project that is successful, not only in the building, but also during the life of the project and the legacy that you're going to give uh, to the society. I think, I think it's always great to get to know other people, you get a lot of information from the news, uh, from media, but it's only when you work and you brainstorm with them that you understand their culture and background and you come up with interesting ideas and solutions. The outcome of this forum was certainly enriching and opened new opportunities for the youth and will benefit both countries on the national and international level. I think it's really important. I've lived outside of Saudi Arabia for a quite long time. So I really understand the importance to meet with different cultures, different mindsets, um, people who have different kinds of experience. I think the events like the one we're having today where Saudi youth and Spanish youth and international students and professors get together is a chance for us to discuss issues that are important to us. It's a chance for us to make new connections with people. And I always like to make a difference between uh, networking and relationships. And I think events like today give us the basis for a relationship or that communication that will last far beyond the event. After the fantastic success of the event, we are all looking forward to the next one that will be held in Saudi Arabia by the end of this year. Thank you so much to all students for their implication during the forum. Hope to see you soon in Saudi Arabia.